Now, a hotel in Hong Kong has been shut for two weeks after four of its staff tested positive for COVID-19. The cluster, linked to the Royal Garden Hotel in Sim Sha Sui, has grown to six cases. All guests have been evacuated and it is closed for deep cleaning. Roland Lim has the details. Here's the news comes as Hong Kong reports eight new coronavirus cases on Friday. Uh, the hotel received a notice from the Center for Health Protection on Thursday night, calling on the hotel to arrange for all of its guests to be evacuated before noon on Friday. Now, the hotel posted on its website that they would be temporarily suspending operations until October 22nd. That's two weeks. And the premises, meantime, will be thoroughly disinfected. Now, the management of the hotel says it will be helping evacuated guests arranged for stays in other hotels upon request. This afternoon, we saw scores of guests actually at the lobby checking out of the hotel, and it's been reported that at least 57 staff members as well have been sent to quarantine centres. Remember on Tuesday, health authorities had confirmed a waiter at the Vietnamese restaurants at the hotel called Le Soleil uh, having contracted disease. Uh, the source of the infection was unknown. So the Center for Health Protection isn't taking any chances. It's already quarantined uh, hotel staff who've been in close contact with the waiter uh, that was infected and also offering tests to guests and other staff. Health authorities also have been asking for customers who ate at that Vietnamese restaurants at the hotel between September 30th and October 3rd to consult a doctor if they feel unwell. Meantime, the Director of Health, Constant Chen, of the city's health department is concerned that the rate of coronavirus infection in Hong Kong is climbing steadily and is warning that the city was now starting to see a rebound in new cases. Now, she described the situation as worrying, and she said that the calculations by the University of Hong Kong has shown that the reproduction rate of the infected cases, known as the R-value, that's uh, risen from below 1 to just above 1. That means one infected person potentially passing it on to another person. Uh, the viral load in some of these cases was also quite high, indicating that the virus was spreading in the community. Meantime, uh, health authorities are also going to meet up with those in the hotel industry to ask them to enforce social distancing guidelines uh, to prevent patrons uh, from partying in rooms. Now, many people have been booking hotels for staycations, and there were reports that people are hosting these parties in hotel rooms, and authorities are studying whether a ban of these gatherings of more than four people should be applied to such events in these hotels.